Hello my beautiful kids and queens, welcome back once again to my lovely channel. So in today's video I have come to show you how to prepare this easy recipe in your house. So here I'll be using beef which I already cut into chunks and also marinated with two tablespoons of soya sauce and beef spice. So I have here green and red bell pepper, I have mushroom, cabbage, I have onion, ginger, garlic, one seasoning cube, I have corn flour, salt, black pepper, I have vegetable oil, dark soya sauce, maggi aroma. You can also use cornstarch for this recipe or you can use the normal flour also bread flour so i'm just going to be using four tablespoons of vegetable oil allow it to heat and then you start by frying your ginger and garlic for 30 seconds before adding in your beef so i'm just using half of this ginger and garlic because at the end I'm going to use the rest when getting to the end so I'm just frying this for 30 seconds and then I'm going to go ahead and add in my beef and I'll be frying this beef for one minute before I add in one tablespoon of salt Mix it together and then I'll add my mushroom. Now fry for another one minute. And then I'm going to go ahead and add the seasoning cube, black pepper. About a tablespoon of black pepper. Then I add my cabbage and then I'm going to cover it and allow it to cook for two minutes. So as you can see, this has been cooking for two minutes now and I'm just going to go ahead and mix everything together very well. You just don't want to overcook this recipe. So here I'm going to add my onions, my green and red bell pepper the rest of the ginger and garlic and then you just go ahead and stir everything together and at this point I'm going to cover it and allow it to cook for another one minute I'll just stir everything together and then at this point I'm going to mix my corn flour with water and then I'm going to go ahead and add it to this sauce As you can see, I just add my corn flour to it, and then you add another half of cup of water to it, and then you mix everything together. So as you can see, I just add half cup of water, and then cover. And then you cook for another one minute because you don't want to overcook this sauce. 
so you can see it's juicy and it's also well tendered not too strong not too soft so at this point i just add one tablespoon of my maggi aroma and also i'll be adding three tablespoons of my dark soya sauce or it depends the way you like it if you want it more darker you can add four to five tablespoons Then just stir everything together well and then after you test for salt if the salt is enough you leave it at it is if you need to add another salt you just add salt so with this salt you can eat with fried rice you can eat with white rice you can also eat with couscous which is very nice also it's very easy and very simple to prepare you don't need much tea to prepare this sauce and i'm going to be serving this with my special rice i boiled with beans with my green beans so as you can see here i have my sauce ready very delicious simple to prepare easy you don't need much time to prepare this sauce and then you enjoy with your family so i'm just going to serve this sauce with my nice rice that i have so here we go guys i hope you guys like this video if you like this video please subscribe to my channel share my video comment down below and uh, i'll be seeing you guys in my next video bye and have a lovely weekend